It's Coco. Coco, beauty. <laughs> I woke up with hair looking like this. I feel like I haven't been filming in a while. So the hair thingy is gonna be a good start. I'm just drinking my coffee now. But let's just jump into my little hair tutorial. First thing, what you need to do is to have a brush and to calm your hair. I just washed my hair last night. I slept with, with wet hair. I usually don't like to use um, a hair dryer. Look at this situation. I feel like I have a nest on my head. So I'm gonna divide my hair into sections now. So it depends how much hair you have. You can just um, start styling right away. But since I have a lot of hair, I'm gonna divide it in three sections. And before I start with styling, I use this, uh, I use a heat protector. I'm using uh, this Living Proof Restore Instant Protection right now. It smells really nice. And it doesn't leave any like greasy or sticky feeling. Some of these heat protectors, you just feel the texture is different when you apply them. So I really like this one, it smells really good. I have another video in which I'm showing different ways of styling your hair using different tools but for my everyday looks I usually just use this when I'm styling my hair I always like my hair to go like away from my face curls on this side are gonna go this way and the curls on that side are gonna go that way I take this clam and I put my hair like this all the way down and I leave this little end right here and I just roll it up you hold it for maybe five seconds and just release. Ta da! On this tool, you can select the temperature. I selected 430, which is the highest, because my hair is really thick and I feel like when I have a lower temperature, it doesn't curl as well. So I'm just gonna leave it like that. When you're doing this, try to. Um, Get smaller pieces of your hair so everything curls properly but this is pretty much it it's not really like a complicated technique it's just how you have to have patience and while I'm doing this I'm not touching my curls because if you would start brushing them right away they're gonna um, kind of go down so when your hair is warm the best if you want to style it more that's when you should do it. I don't know if that made any sense, but... And this hair curler, I think I paid $50 for it, and it's really good. I have to check, I think this is one, one and a half barrel, like a thickness. But I mean, you can get a bigger one, a smaller one, so depending on the size of your barrel, is it barrel? Depending on the size of your barrel, that's how big your curls are gonna be. So if you want your curls to be more defined, you should you should look for a thinner one. So now I'm gently just kind of brushing through my curls. And I have to say I'm really lucky with my hair because when I style it once it's probably gonna stay like that for the next until the next wash. So I curl my hair just every time I wash it. Maybe I need to do a touch up every now and then, depending on what I was doing the past couple of days. Okay, we did this this side of the hair, so now I'm gonna go on this side. And what I was saying is about so this all of these are going that way, and this ones are gonna go this way. So you just kind of flip the barrel. Same thing. You just pull it all the way down. I know there's so many different techniques people use to style their hair. I just feel like this is so easy and quick. Let me know in the comments what kind of videos you would like to see when it comes to hair. I am a makeup artist, but I also do like easy styling. I style my hair in various ways, but this is just uh, the quickest and easiest thing I do. What else is new with you guys? I feel like this year literally flew by. I don't even know what I did this year. Okay, so the first layer is done. Take off your hair. So I'm gonna divide this into two more layers. So the 
style hair, I kind of just move in the back. I don't want to clamp it with anything because I don't want to ruin the curl. Brush through it again. Again, using this living proof heat protector. I know some people they just spray the heat protector at the beginning throughout the whole, like all over their hair, but I just like to do layer by layer. Ready. With these first ones, you should be the most careful because that's first thing people see so these guys have to be pretty and the reason why I always leave this little piece of hair is that I feel like it looks more loose so if I would go all the way like if I would curl it all the way I feel like it would give such a more official vibe and I still want my hair to look I don't want it to look too stuck up hair is very important you have to make sure your hair looks nice. Because somebody told me hair is the only accessory you wear every single day. So your hair is half the battle. So if your hair looks nice, it's like you're good. See you in this. So when I'm gonna be done with everything, I'm gonna retouch some pieces if I feel like I skip them and this is it you, you, you just roll this side and roll that side and roll this side and roll that side okay and the third layer is coming up guys tell me what kind of videos you want to see and uh, leave me a comment tell me what do you want to see do you want to see more hair you want to see more makeup you want to see more my camera just stopped working out of nowhere i hope it filmed because if it didn't i'm gonna be very upset so you see it now how like all the curls are kind of down here if you want to add them a little up here just grab whatever piece and start from there You know my explanations aren't the best when it comes to wording, but hopefully you see what I do. You can see how we created this new curl here now. Ow. <laughs> I literally just burned myself. Okay, and something I always do is I can get a mirror and I look at myself both ways. So so I can see if I need to fix anything. Maybe like this. There's always that one piece that I can never do right away. I always need to fix this piece, literally. Okay. So you can either leave it like that or you can brush it one more time. I like to brush it because then everything falls into place and becomes... I'm gonna use texturizing hairspray that gives you a more lived-in look oh this is from away it's literally just called texturizing hairspray but after this you will lose that silky touch that your hair has on my ends I'm gonna use this Kerastase elixir ultimate and this is also good to get rid of any flyaways
And if you really want to go wild, you can also use this uh, Away Hair and Body Shine Mist. Just makes your hair really shiny. I don't know if the camera is catching it, but it's shining in person. So now, like the way you want to do it, it's up to you. You can just, you know, leave this piece hanging. You can put it in behind the ear, then kind of look. You can just do whatever you want now, but this is basically how I curl my hair and then Later if I want to add something else I do but this is the base When I have my hair done, I feel like my life is more put together than it usually is so I always like to have nice hair If you like this video share it with your best friend tell her. Oh, I Just found this great hair tutorial online